First at five, nearly 30 members of the Tulsa Police Department are in Washington, D.C. this evening as Sergeant Craig Johnson is honored for making the ultimate sacrifice. Thank you for joining us this evening. I'm Brian Dorman. And I'm Lori Fulbright. Businesses and people in Tulsa donated money to send the Tulsa Police Honor Guard, Sergeant Johnson's family, as well as Officer Arresh Zargajan to D.C. this week. And News on 6's Regan Ledbetter is live in D.C. with this report for us. Regan. Lori and Brian, the Honor Guard members tell me they feel like they had to be here this week, not only to show support for Sergeant Johnson's family, but to show support for all the officers who've lost their lives. As a whole team coming, uh, I think that was it was meant to be, you know, everybody be here and and take part in that. The Tulsa Police Honor Guard sends a couple members each year to National Police Week to pay their respects, but this year was different. The Tulsa Police Foundation helped raise thousands of dollars to make sure the entire team could come this year. Since it's the first time in 25 years, a Tulsa officer's name has been added to the law enforcement memorial. So to come here and, just like I said, take, take part in all of this and just, I don't know, just take it all in, it makes you proud of what you do as an Honor Guard member. Craig Vincent Johnson. Sergeant Johnson's name was one of 701 names of fallen officers read at a candlelight vigil at the National Mall last night. Tulsa Police Chief Wendell Franklin is also here. Here to see all of us come together and, uh, and share this commonality, it, 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 makes us, uh, it makes us stronger. Chief Franklin says it's comforting knowing Sergeant Johnson's legacy will always be a part of history here. When you have a person that you really know and that you work with and work beside, it really makes the wall mean something now. They're, our, they're part of our family and they always will be and we won't forget Craig's name ever. Now this is pretty special. Several members of the Tulsa Honor Guard have volunteered to escort families of fallen officers from other states tomorrow at a memorial service at the U.S. Capitol. Live in Washington, D.C., Reagan Ledbetter, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.